everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Uh, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits. Crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on on jamiezebra23.com. Also, um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Keep in mind that the readings are general, so this is not, they are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. Also, keep in mind... Um, that um, you must place an order before I can schedule you. So there's no need to email me and ask me what's on the website when you can simply go to the website and check yourself, right? So, um, and if you have any questions about the items on my website, you simply go to the description box of the item on the website and it tells you the times, the dates, um, when you should hear back from me, what the protocol is, all of that can simply be found by just going to the website and looking at the description. All right, guys, uh, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Ta-ta for now. Hi, my cancers. It's Jamie Seaver 23. I am doing your week of May 25th, 2020 general reading for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. So let's see what the energies are for the week. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. You've got the judgment card. Think before you do. You got to think first. Some of you need to watch how you're coming across to a potential uh, love, love interest and potential, um, potential employers. Oh. Yeah, somebody may not, I'm seeing somebody might be disgusted with you guys. They could be disgusted with you or you could be disgusted with them. It could, keep in mind guys, the energies are vice versa. Let's see what this one is. Yep, watch what you say. You guys have to watch how you're coming across. I don't think that, I don't even think that you guys are, let me let, let this unfold. So I feel like it's almost like you say the same things all the time. It's like, I've been, I've been acting like this forever. Nobody's ever said anything. I've been doing this forever. What, what's the big problem now? It could be the retrograde. That's the problem. So like, let's say your husband, wife, boyfriend, or girlfriend, you do the same thing you always do. They might be like, that's it. I'm leaving. This is the straw that breaks the camel's back. I'm out. And you might be like, okay, what did I say? What did I do? Same thing with employers. Maybe this is the same thing you've always done. The same ideas, the same stance. I'm picking up political. For some of you, you may, you know, you may be talking politics at work and your boss may fire you or be like, oh no, I don't want to hear that. Be very, very careful guys because, um, you know, I don't want to, and I don't want to sound offensive and my, my moon is cancer so I'm not talking smack or anything um so for example you guys have to understand this you know a lot of people think not just me but a lot of people think that if you're a Trump supporter you're probably a dishonest person that you're probably you know a racist or a liar it's not just me who thinks this and it doesn't mean it's it doesn't mean it's even true but you got to understand that if you say like those ideals, like the kind of things that Trump says, um, people might look at you like you're not a trustworthy person or you're not a nice person, but it goes the same way. There's a lot of people who think that if you're anti-Trump, that you're a horrible person, that you're a liar and that you're the crazy one. So you got to understand either whether or not you're a Trump supporter or not. Try to keep politics out of your relationships if possible, especially if they're kind of new. And also try to keep that out of the workplace because people might literally fire you over it. You know, you got to understand that um, it's the same thing because most people think Trump supporters are ungodly. But then Trump supporters, many Trump supporters think that people who are not Trump supporters are ungodly. So you got to understand that, you know, people are, you know, 33% of the United States, you know, are pro-Trump. And the majority are not. So 
but each side thinks the same thing about the other. Each side thinks the same thing. So they think, you know, Trump supporter bad, not Trump supporter bad. So just understand that. So I'm not, I'm not telling people what to think or what to believe, but just try to, it shows here that that's what's going on here this week. So watch it. Also, some of you were fired maybe, you know, four weeks ago, four months ago, four days ago, or you will be fired in four days. Let's stop the firing by not, don't talk about this stuff. Even if they ask you, even if they tell you that, don't say it because you might get fired. Now let's talk about something else. Okay. So I do see that for some of you, um, somebody's going to be trying to move back in or your relationship is, is going to a different state. So it looks like if somebody was on the fence of if they're going to label this like, oh, are, are we forever? Is this, are we getting married? Are we engaged? Some of you may be moving in with somebody, somebody that you thought the relationship was over with. Also, some of you have a Virgo that's lurking around. There's a Virgo that's lurking around romantically. They're interested in you romantically. You may know this person or you may have never spoken to this person. They just may be sizing you up. I don't think it's stalking. I don't think it's abuse. I think it's just like, wow, that person's really handsome or really pretty. You know, I want to look at them. I feel like they may actually message you, text you, call you, cat call you. Uh, they might be like, hey, what's up? Hi. <laughs> I also see that for those of you that are waiting on a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo, or a fellow water sign, a Cancer Pisces, or a Scorpio to reach out, it may happen, but slowly. It may not be this week. I do see that for those of you that are married, you may be going through some changes, some ups and downs, or for those of you dealing with a Taurus or a fire sign, there may be some issues, some romantic issues happening. So just, um, it's just going to be some bickering, but there could also be competition. There may be somebody who's thinking that the grass is greener, but I do feel like for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers, you guys will get over this hump. This also could be a situation of somebody who's left their husband or wife and they now live with you. And they, they're debating on whether or not they should go back to their husband or their wife. Of course, for each person, it's going to be a different outcome. They may very well go back to their husband or wife, or they may stay with you. With the Eight of Swords in the reverse here and the Four of Cups, again, with the filter, watch yourselves. Watch your mouths. Watch what you say. Because um, somebody could just, you know, be like, uh, no, sorry, I, we don't allow that over here. So somebody needs to watch how they're coming across. And this may have, I'm picking up it's political, but this may not have to do with that. It could be as bad as like you saying, oh crap, or suck it up buttercup. Maybe somebody doesn't like those phrases. So you got to understand that, you know, if you're employed by somebody, you kind of have to go by their rules, that kind of thing. Um, so watch it there. I do see the Seven of Wands and the King of Cups, which could be the Queen of Cups. Some of you will end up hanging out with a, with a water sign, a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. Big emphasis on Scorpio. You'll hang out, you'll hit it off, and then you won't see them again. So it may not be never see them again but it will be a long stretch before you see or hear from them again. So it's kind of like, hang out with me, hang out with me, hang out with me. Then you hang out with them. You have like the best time ever. And then it's like, they're not taking my calls. They're not answering me. What happened? You'll hear from them again, but maybe in August. All right, my Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers have an amazing week. JamieZebra23.com to talk for now. Oh, um, I've got a second tarot card channel. It's JamieZebra23 chat. If you want to go over there, like, share, and subscribe. If you've ordered a same-day reading or an $8 one question, one answer via email only, and you've not heard from me, feel free to email me to let me know so that I can hurry up and answer you or hurry up and uh, do your reading. Um, the reading special is going on for a few more hours on JamieZebra23.com. Um, ta ta for now. It's Jimmy Zebra 23. Sorry to interrupt the reading, but if you guys are interested in a personal reading, you can simply go to the first 30 seconds of this video and it tells you um, where to make a purchase, jamiezebra23.com. It tells you about the same day reading, so you don't have to wait. Same day readings. Also an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. Plus I've got tons of products on the website for protection, for cleansing, for energetic healing, all sorts of goods on the website, jamiezebra23.com. You simply go to the first 30 seconds of the video and it will explain all of this stuff. No need to email me to ask me if I do personal readings when you can simply go to the first 30 seconds and also the description box says it too. jamiezebra23.com. Enjoy the rest of your reading.